Hello friends, good morning, good afternoon, good evening. So and as you understand, this review is about CMR University and I am going to review about their MBA course, right? So before that, CMR University is a part of CMR group of institutions. So they do have a large number of educational institutions under its. So there are around 20,000 students who are studying in CMR group and in those are spread in 30 countries, right? So talking about the CMR group of institution, as I mentioned, there is a group of uh, large number of institutions. So some of them in engineering field and others are like CMR IT, which is their engineering college and NAC A++ accredited institution. And this is the main CMR college and located out of uh, uh, White, uh, Whitefield area, right? And then there is a CMR national public school. There is a different lot of public schools you can see. They have a CMR and National PU College. They have a C N NPS International School and Ekalya Schools spread ac all across uh, Bangalore and South India. Yeah. So they ha have got the Emerging University of the Year Award by SHM New Delhi. And they have also given Best University in South India 2022 by different educational research. So they do have a multiple campuses. So first it is important to understand different campuses. So they have called the Lakeside Campus, right? CMR University Lakeside Campus, which is in Baglur Main Road, Chagalahatti, right? That is the address. Then they have the city campus, which is located in, based out of HRBR layout in Kalyan Nagar. And you can see the address here. And the last one is the OMBR Campus, which is located in Bhavanagari area within the OMBR layout in Bangalore so three campuses and these are the photos of the um, three campuses so top campus is the best one which is the lakeside campus and you can see the modern infrastructure you can also see the lakeside campus buildings hostel blocks and then the OMBR campus uh, on the bottom side and you can also see city campus. So the next two campuses which is OMBR and city campuses are very small campuses compared to the lakeside campus which is the main campus for CMS University. So as I said it is the main campus lakeside campus is very big and it's a decent 60 acre lake front campus and uh, it's located in the north Bangalore as I mentioned. So this is the main entrance of the lakeside campus and these are some of the pictures of their teaching. And now talking about different schools of studies within the CMR University, right? So they have a school of architecture, school of design, school of engineering, social sciences and then economic and commerce, school of management, school of science studies, legal studies and education. So a lot of schools are there within the CMR University, but I'm going to talk only about the School of Management in this particular video. So talking about the School of Management, they have the MBA program, right? And they take admission through different modes of admission. They have their own exam called CMR UAT, which is also taking admission for MBA. Apart from CMR UAT, you can also give PGCET, KMAT and many national exams they accept. Now regarding the three campuses, PGCET code, right? So city campus, PGCET code is B150, uh, Lakeside campus 395 and the OMBR campus 149. Now talking about the different specializations which are offered part of school of management. So yes, the program is MBA with dual specialization. So you can basically select two specializations from the options. So you have available specializations like finance, uh, marketing, human resource, digital marketing, and then there is a supply chain management and business analytics. So good number of branches are available. You can take a dual specialization and also they have executive MBA also uh, in the field of product leadership. Now talking about the placement. So this is the pl placement information of 2022 and is provided in their brochure. So you can see uh, average salary and the other highest salary trends right so highest salary in 2022 batch was 7 lakhs yes you heard correct 7 lakhs was the highest salary in 2022 batch and the top 10 percent students average was 6.2 lakhs top 20 percent average was 5.8 lakhs and overall average was 4.5 lakhs so that is the detail provided by the college and the type of companies which are visiting here you can see most are IT companies, Delight, Oracle, PwC, you know, Bosch, 
KPMG, EY, consulting and the IT companies are most of the on the campus plus some like you know ICICI Bank, HDFC Life which is finance side. Not talking about the placement details which are given in the NIRF placement document right. So it talks about the 3 year placement. So in 20 passing batch into 19 20 passing batch 184 students were there and 90 of them got job which which means uh, out of uh, eligible student 50 percent got job with the package very very low which is 2.45 lakhs next year in 21 passing batch 195 eligible students and only 97 got job again 50 percent or less than 50 percent with the median salary very very low 2.8 lakhs and in 22 passing batch right 213 students eligible and 150 of them get so percentage uh, increased right in terms of the number of placements and the median salary increased also to 3.3 lakhs so this is the data of their pg course in cmr university and overall placement details so that's all i have to cover thanks for watching and please do subscribe channel to get similar updates on all colleges in karnataka take care and bye